Hey, Yuito. Want to take a walk around Suo with me? Okay. I was just looking to blow off some steam. Great. Let's go then. I mean, I wouldn't say we've reached peace yet, but it's still relaxing to walk around this city. Yeah, I really like Suo. It calms me down when I'm stressed. Me too. I hope we can truly attain peace one day. In our next story, new information has been uncovered regarding the inhumane experiments conducted at the OSF hospital. That news. OSF hospital chairman Yanagi Ichijo had denied any involvement. But among the leaked data provided by a whistleblower included documents signed by Mr. Ichijo himself. It's unlikely that the 10 members implicated in these accusations, including Mr. Ichijo, will be able to avoid any fallout. It seems like the researcher we saved came through. Yeah, the Ichijo family name could be ruined now, but that's better than thriving through evil deeds. How is your family doing? Have your parents experienced any blowback? No, I contacted them, but they really didn't know anything about it. They were actually worried for me that the OSF might try something. I'm glad they're okay. Yeah, I'm so relieved because for a second I was worried they could be involved. Maybe I'll go visit them soon. What was that sound? It sounded like a crash. Let's go check it out. Over there! An accident! A traffic accident? That's unusual. Excuse me! Do you know what happened here? It seems like the car's auto-drive program malfunctioned. The rescue team hasn't shown up yet. Are you with the OSF? I guess that means you can't really do anything. <sighs> Let's get a closer look. Yeah, there might be something we can do. Help! My son is in one of the cars! He's still trapped inside! There's smoke coming from the engine. The kid could be in danger unless we get him out. We don't have time to wait for the rescue team. Let's do what we can. Help! Just hold on a little longer for us. We're going to get you out of there soon. <sighs> it's locked. Can you remove the door with your psychokinesis? I could, but I might accidentally hurt the kid if I try to force it open. If only there was a way we could open it more gently. Okay, I'll try then. What are you going to do? I'm going to use my pyrokinesis to see if I can melt one of the parts inside of the door. That should make it come off easier. Okay, do it. Am I going to die? Don't worry. We're going to save you. Trust me. Can you back away from the door for me? Okay. <sighs> Yuito, you're up. Got it. Here we go. <clears throat> Good job. Your mom is waiting for you. Mom! Thank you so much. I really can't thank you enough. Please, you don't need to thank us. I'm glad your son is safe. Um, thank you for saving me. Hey, I saw what happened. The OSF sure is amazing. Let's hear it for the Scarlet Guardians. What? When did this crowd gather? Everyone, please step back. It's still dangerous. The rescue team just arrived. I think we can leave the rest to them. As much as I want to see this through to the end, we should leave before the crows show up and get in the way. Whew. You were really cool. You acted so decisively, even when that was our first time dealing with an accident. What? No, I didn't. I was just desperately trying to save that boy. Well, I still think that's cool. Thanks. I think I figured out what I want to do. You finally got your answer? Yeah. I had an idea, 
but today really solidified it. I want to protect what I love, though I don't mean someone specific. I love this city and the people who live here, and I want to protect all of them. I don't want any of them to suffer. <laughs> I agree. I'm done with all this sadness that keeps happening. That's why I want to change the OSF first, so that what my uncle did will never happen again. I mean, they call us the Scarlet Guardians. We need to live up to our name. Guardians? Just like you were back there. T don't tease. But you might be right. Protecting people doesn't just mean fighting. I mean, even if we get rid of all the others in the world someday, accidents like that will still happen. Get rid of them all? I never thought that far ahead before, but you're right. In other words, our fighting ends when we defeat all our enemies. But protecting people is a job that will never end. Wow. I'm so impressed that you'd think so far ahead. I'm proud to be your childhood friend. <laughs> I mean, it might be a big endeavor, but I plan to start little by little. Besides, I only started thinking about these kinds of things because of you. I didn't have any ideals up until now. Seeing you run ahead, I wanted to catch up and run beside you. Then I finally found the path I was looking for. <laughs> what? I never thought for a second I was running ahead of you. Since I came in as a volunteer soldier, I've always been frantically trying to catch up to you. <laughs> then I guess we both helped each other grow. Let's go with that. Both of us will keep moving forward. Yes. This is the all-important first step after all. Yuito? Huh? What is it? There's something I want to tell you when I feel like I finally caught up to you. What's that? It's a secret until the time comes. A secret? I don't really understand. But okay. I'll wait. Thank you. <laughs> well, I'm going on ahead. Hey, wait up! Oh, she's already gone. That's so Hanabi. Thanks, Yuito. For what? I didn't do anything. When I see you working so hard, it makes me want to work hard too. I think I've matured a little, but it's not enough yet. I'm not just going to follow after you. I'm going to get better than you and pull you up to my level. So you better be ready. <laughs> <laughs>